Alrighty, welcome in, welcome in. We are here. We are here. This is Commander John J. Beck. And we got a show today. So we're going to be doing more Hogwarts Legacy. Uh, pretty much, we started over as a Gryffindor. Um, going to make sure all the sound is good here. Going to sit right here for a second. Make sure my sound is good. Make sure I can hear everything properly. All the levels. The Xbox, literally, I started up. Xbox wasn't working, so I had to reconnect that. Do that whole shindig again. Sounds like my voice quality is good. Well, that sounds good. I'm happy with that. Hope everybody's doing good today. I got a couple people in here already. Welcome in. Welcome in. Welcome in. Welcome in. Good to see you guys. Welcome in. It's a good day so far. Um, you know, had a partially torn Achilles. Was on a crutch cast for a little while. Man. What a process. Today, we got the cane boot off. We are in another shoe. We're looking good. I'm happy. We're going to stream today. Man, I'm excited. All right, let me... this one. Let's see how we're doing here. Let me see how that is. I was having a 10 second delay the other day. All right, everything sounds good. I think we're good to go. We're gonna do some exploring. Like last time I kinda, I played through the main story and I did it quick and there were a lot of camps I didn't go to, a lot of collection chests I didn't get. And looking back, not that it was, not that it was the wrong thing to do, because it wasn't the wrong thing to do right i did what i wanted to do I'm gonna cut this music off now we don't need that music anymore so we'll go ahead and cut that music off hopefully everything is still sound the same i'm gonna throw a few more spells out there and listen to it and make sure everything is good but you know like pretty much what i didn't do that i wanted to do last time was probably, you know, uh, investigating more of the chest and getting a lot of the collections. Ace, are you live? Are you live, dude? I uh, was, you know, getting the collection chest, doing a lot of that stuff. I didn't do that last time. And so there were a lot of things. Like, I'm at the end of the game, and literally... <gasps> 
I don't have everything. And so, a little disappointed by that. Here, let me actually, I want to make sure. Where did I, go? I want to make sure that, that this, because when I changed this setting last time, it just wasn't working. And I just want to make sure. So let me send this out, and then you guys tell me how it looks on your end as well. Let me just make sure. Because I don't want want the quality to be good for you guys you hear this all right we sound good so i'm happy with that yeah we're gonna we're gonna explore a little bit i might do a couple of the early missions so we can get talent points and level up just a little bit because we definitely want to level up just a little bit it's on hard so i want to level up a little bit just so the enemies are not like too crazy but then we definitely want to explore more than we want to uh, just dive in and do all the missions. I don't think I want to do that like I did last time. So the goal will be definitely doing a bit more of the missions first. Making sure that we're happy with that. And then going from there. You know what I mean? I think that's my, that's my plan on how to attack this playthrough. It's just make sure I had breakfast this morning with coffee, like a latte, and I am like <laughs> all fucking day today. Just like my whole fucking stomach has been fucked up all day today. All right, let's get this on. Let's get our music at the right headset level. Oh, we're looking good. We're looking good. My girl got all the snacks. We got multiple sour. We got multiple Sour Patch. We got, man, it's really hard to reach over there. Swedish Fish. Fruit Gushers. We we are ready to go on the snacks, I tell you what. These peach ones are awesome. If you've had the Sour Patch Sweets. These things are so good. So good. So, that being said, let's get in playing formation here. I'm really excited. I'm excited for this playthrough today. I think it's going to be good. I think it's going to be everything we need. Everything that we want to do today, I think we're going to get done. We'll see how it goes. Probably shouldn't chew the candy right into the microphone, but that's what we're doing. Um... Yeah, we're going to try to... I don't know if we're going to 100% this one or not. I mean, it was a total of 60 hours on the last one. So we'll see how this goes. Let's explore a little bit. See what we find. Rebellion. Hmm. Where's this thing? No, right next to me. Let's go ahead and start collecting things. Alright, let's do this class. We can do the first couple classes. I don't have that spell yet. Get going here. Gonna take our time. Nice. See? We're already leveling up slowly here. Collect some field pages. Get going. I'm going to try to get up to like, uh, you know, level five quicker than. Where's this sucker at? Over here? Yeah. Nice. Playing with the headphones on really does help. I wait to you. Unfortunately, I already know what this is. <laughs> Can't wait to head down there. Uh, we're not we're not gonna do the curses this time, man. We're Oh, I don't know. Me. You can't imagine Go ahead and get that. I'm liking the 
I'm liking the reflections on the floor. We're going to check that out a little bit later. I'm sure we'll get that one. Yeah, we're going to do... We'll do a few of the first quests. And then go from there. You'd be good enough to blast each other to pieces in your own time. I get new students every year, but I only have one Hebridean black skull. It was a token from the great poacher raid of 1878. No doubt you've heard of it. Now, you may be asking yourself how an old woman like me single to the largest poacher ring in eastern Wales and lived to boast about it. Knowledge. To the wise, age matters very little. Tasha, thank you. Today we will review a spell that has saved Debra, yes. Wizards more times than I can right. remember. Levioso. Levioso. A levitation charm. Levioso. A surprised opponent we is a weak opponent. Care to defend yourself, Master Pruitt? No? My friends are in the... My friends are in my text I chat right now just going crazy because I'm... Value of I'm healthy. Especially We're healthy. Back. We're back. Now, let's We're back. We're with. healthy. Starting with something small. We're back. Ooh, Levioso. Okay. We'll do this one first. Oh, my cat's going absolute berserk right now. Alright, let's do it. Bam. Bam. All right, one spell down. I am Gary Trotter in this playthrough. Gary Trotter. Now let's try something a little larger. Famous Gryffindor. Let us begin with a basic cost. This thing is so lame. See how the dump deflected your cost? Yes. This time, <laughs> cast Levioso first, then the basic cost. Yeah, Remember, a surprised opponent is a weak opponent. As Master Levioso. Now, well done. Woo! There we go. Very good. But the best way to practice is by dueling. We'll start with you two. Duelist, take your marks. Time for a proper Hogwarts welcome. Now, <laughs> All right. There we go. Levioso, Why is... Cost and Protego. You may begin. This should be easy. This cannot be your first duel. Let's just say I'm a quick learner. Seven cold students with this adept. Super Pluto. Levioso. I do enjoy a lively duel. There we go. Not bad for a beginner. <laughs> you give as good as you get. Put you on the spot, and you rose to the challenge. Well, yeah. Cheers to Gryffindor. Sweet. Thank you, Professor Hackett. Glad to have the Appreciate that. To practice. If what I've seen today is any indication, we can expect great things from you. I demand excellence from my students. They are capable of achieving it, and they must achieve it. Well, oh, thanks. A classroom duel is one thing. But battling dark wizards, or as ever more likely, goblins, is a different kettle of Grindelows entirely. Understood, Professor. Mm. So, I'd advise you to keep practicing whenever you can. Perhaps Mr. Sallow will have some ideas for you. Again, well, we'll see. Done today. I shall reach out soon with additional assignments. So excited about these peach shower oh, patches. Right. That's 
enough spectacle for one day. Class is dismissed. We killed it. Per the use. Right. Huh. Always thought Levioso was for first years. Not anymore. Oh. I'm not much for dueling. <laughs> I prefer to keep things friendly. Alright, bye bud. Nice work. I enjoyed that. Well that duel was quite something. Everyone will be talking about it. It was certainly good practice. Practice? It felt more like I was dueling an expert. Sebastian Sallow, by the way. Didn't expect him to Gary, be Gary Trotter. so deft with a wand. Then again, perhaps this wasn't your first... Gary Trotter. In fact, it was. Perhaps I have a knack for it. Be coy if you like, but I know better. Magic requires intention and talent. I don't know why I picked you know, that voice. It's a perfect fit for a certain exclusive, unsanctioned jewel that he just ruined. Exclusive and unsanctioned. Count me in. Excellent. Knew I was right about you. If you want to get the most, it sounds Elf interesting. Hogwarts, you're going to need to break the rules now and then. That. Whether it's joining a secret dueling club or sneaking into the restricted section of the library, you just have to be clever enough not to get caught. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll keep that in mind. Good. Pleasure chatting with you. I'm sure I'll see you soon. Perhaps somewhere unsanctioned? Hmm. We'll see if your performance today was sheer luck or actual skill. Look for Luke and Brattleby near the clock tower entrance. All right, I will. If you're interested. <laughs> Till next time. All right. Nice. All right. There we go. Let's go ahead and see what we did here. One percent. <laughs> All right. All right. Already got some things going on now. Looking good. Got lots of good stuff going on here. All right. Rebellion. There we go. Might as well start getting this stuff now. I think once we get to level five or so, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be happy with how we're doing here. Experiencing a little lag on my end. How's it looking on yours? What's up, dude? What you doing today? I, uh, I'm good, dude. I literally got out of the doctors. I, uh, had partially torn my Achilles months ago. So I've either been in a cast, a cane boot, something. And today I finally got all that off. I'm Hello. done. I am it's just physical therapy. And going from there. I am <coughs> so excited. Shall we begin? <laughs> Everything sound okay? To year five of charms. Now, this will be a crucial year in your education on the art of charm work. But I am... I was having an issue, uh... Take hold. With a passion and rigor requisite of such where my sound was a bit behind now, yesterday but it looks a lot better this to today but before we begin can anyone here tell me the difference it looks like it's on in the incantations of the color change looks like it's on charms. anyone anyone my back in the middle school mm -hmm. playing baseball not a good feeling uh, uh, Ugh. I, am afraid I was playing basketball with the homies now. 
did a move I've done since I was a kid. By the looks of it, you all spent your Pow! practicing oblivious on one another. <laughs> Back tire blew out. Went to the free throw line. Shot a free throw. Didn't make it. But, uh, you know, had to try. And uh, found out I had a torn Achilles. I, I figure that's what it was, though. Let me turn my headset down a little bit. I figure that's what it was, though, because uh, I torn a calf muscle before. Felt exactly the same. Felt like a softball hit me. Man. Been a great day. Went to work. Set them up. Also, dude, if you haven't tried these Sour Patch Peaches, man, they're so good. My girl got me a whole bunch of snacks. Oh, thank you, baby. Sweet. Oh, man. It's been a journey. It has been a journey. That is not bad. Not the, the greatest thing ever. I got a sweetest fish, couple sour pads, some fruit gushers. We are set up, ready to go. Ready to go. I read something that some people want uh, some rom romantic interest. How do you feel about that? How do you feel about the romantic interest? I uh, don't think I care about that too much. Like, at all. I did not play this game to have a Hogwarts intercourse. I've always found that fun goes I, hand so, hand apparently, hand some people sure. were... Kind of like, I mean, I don't know if you played Cyberpunk. <laughs> it was a disaster, but... So if you did play it, you know what I mean? Like the romantic interests and stuff. I don't know if I'm... Yeah, exactly. I I don't know if I have any interest in, a, in like a Hogwarts relationship. Is something else I have to maintain? I'm good. I think I'm good on that. All right. If I remember this correctly, wait till he gets to the orange. Let go. I got a girl at home. I don't need a girl on the computer. Nice. Think of this like gobstones, if you will. But instead of throwing the marbles out, you are summoning them toward you. Very good. There we go. A little long on that one. That one got dangerously close. Excellent control there. There we go. Very good. Points to Gryffindor. Sweet. But there's certainly no sport in playing without some friendly competition. Let's do it. Miss Onai, would you care to give our new student a bit of a challenge? Come on up. You'll be the blues just as before. And Miss Onai, you are playing red. Clear? Yes, sir. Let's do it. Watch this. All right, bro, bro. Thank you for coming in, hanging out for a little bit. Have a good dinner. All right, so I think the best thing that we can do is go ahead and knock hers off here. Oh, that didn't work. Well, that sure as hell didn't work. I'm going to do way better on that one. We gotta knock one of hers off for sure now. Yeah. Gary Trotter's turn. There we go. Come on, come on. There we go. Oh, that was an execution. Nice. That's what we need to do. Don't you do it, girl. All right, we're good now. There we go. As long as we land this one, anywhere. Come on. There we go, guys. There we go. Sick. Wonderful job. Exactly what we wanted to do. 
very happy with the performance. I was uh, impressed by your Let performance. A bit more interesting, shall we? I was uh, impressed uh, by your performance. Ooh, am I going first? <laughs> I think we are well past interesting at this point. Alright. I'll say. She Enough first, or am I first? Focus now, you will need it. And she's this first. round settles it all. All right, so she got that. Wait. Now. Splendid. Uh. I'm watching, girl. I'm watching. much we even get 20 we're good oh we're already we already won perfect perfect score remarkable I'm that guy I don't know if you know this profess but I'm that guy very good both of you well done I am that guy. Just that guy. Class is dismissed. Gather your things on the way out. Good game, Basta. I must admit, I think I underestimated you. Took me weeks to become proficient with Akio. Took weeks for me to get anything right when I transferred here. It well, gets easier, okay. I promise. Oh, thanks. That's good to hear. It's a lot to take in all at once. To put it lightly, I don't know. I don't know if y'all hear the I same how I felt when I first started. voice issues I'm hearing. I here from Wagadu, just before my fourth year. My mother received an offer to teach divination here. Before I knew it, we had left Uganda and were halfway around the world at a new school in a new country. Well, it's nice to meet you. Well, it's been nice talking and competing with you. And with you. Ah, I think Professor Ronan wants to talk to you. Better not keep him waiting. Until next time. Hey, let me make sure. Of course, you can use Akio on humans, if you're so inclined. Well, make you sure, can uh... use it on clothing to be precise, Vasti. You know it won't work on humans. I'll go speak to him in one second. Let me get this thing going here. Something happened in the Discord there. Everybody's doing good today. Did everything we had to do with that. Hit up some people. I want to make sure that uh, I gotta make sure my uh, 
thing is working here for this, just in case. Sometimes my homie will show up. Every once in a while, because, you know, I try to do the multi-stream. But every once in a while, I'm just not impressed because the... I don't feel like it quite works with the uh, YouTube for me. I don't feel like my YouTube stream comments I get in all the time. If you would, you wanted to speak with me, Professor. I did. I trust your first charms lesson lived up to expectations. Well, an outfit competition wasn't exactly the lesson I was expecting, sir. What charm is there in the expected? You did well managing to best as gifted a student as Miss Onai. Thank you, Professor. I enjoyed the match. Miss Onai is always a fierce competitor, though I sense that she is a bit distracted of late. <clears throat> now, Professor Weasley has asked that your professors give you instruction outside of the ordinary curriculum. Swedish fish! Expect to hear from me soon regarding a special assignment that I am preparing for you. Thanks, bro, bro. All right, got some early spells going on. Rebellion. There we go. No, it's in there. Dang it. Hello there. You're the new student, aren't you? I sure am. What do you want? Hello. You wanted to speak to me. Samantha Dale. I've been eager to meet you. You're the student everyone's been whispering about. Hope your first day is going well. You certainly seem to hold your own in charms. Oh, thanks. I've been fortunate. Beginner's luck. <laughs> My brother William would tell you not to be so humble and to trust your abilities. Then again, he tends to be overconfident in his. Well, better see to my charms homework. I'm afraid I can't count on beginner's luck to impress Professor Ronan. Hmm. Rebellion. There we go. Rebellion. Oh, what fun! I won't say my goodbyes. I shall cheer for the boy who says you're telling lies. I'm not telling lies, please. It was Albert Root. Ooh. Uh, yep. There we go. Rebellion. Hey, this part's gonna be nice and easy, huh? On the other side of this wall. Yep, right here. Nice. Seven, eight. There's just so much here. There's just too much here. Rebellion. You literally walk everywhere in the castle and get something. Astronomy Tower. Damn. Oh, sorry. What am I supposed to be doing right now?
What's going on with this thing here? Like glitched. Am I good? So we need to go. We want to learn as many spells as possible. So we want to do that first. Then when we do that, we can start going to the camps, exploring a little bit. We want to get a good basis first before you just start running out there. Alright, we already did this. Cool little birds. Rebellion. that coming from yeah that's by me Oop. Boop. what are you up to now Trying to find stuff. Welcome in, welcome in. Oh yeah, there's another one. Eight to eight. Slowly get these challenges. Get these challenges going. If it's you, Freddy, let me know. Alright, we're working our way. We're working our way back into these challenges. We need to go downstairs. Rebellion. Nothing there. Pretty much all the stuff that you see is pretty much an opportunity. <laughs> to get something. Yeah, we gotta go outside, but before we go outside. Let's see if this is one. Nope. Mm. We're gonna find one. Welcome to our second playthrough. We did. <laughs> Thank you, bro. I uh, I had a few people that that are some of my regular viewers drop on you. I think uh, I told Tasha and um, I think it's Deborah to to check you out as well. So hopefully they followed you. <laughs> Gave you some love. I appreciate you, dude. Rebellion. We are going back for a second 100% completion. I don't know if we're going to 100% this one. It took a long time. But I, I do want to explore more. I don't feel like I explored nearly... Thanks, bro. I don't feel like I explored nearly as much as I should have. What about the room, Professor? I was thinking the same thing, Dee. Perhaps you could help. I saw that you had six or seven people watching you last night, so that in itself was a good accomplishment, man. So congrats. We both gotta keep keep going, keep getting to that level. I trust your first classes went well. Sweet as fish. It did, Professor. I heard as much <laughs> from Professors Hecate and Ronan. Seems Professor Fig taught you quite a bit during your brief detour near... I do have what some... What you said? I do have some lighting things? issues here and there. I'd wager there's a good deal more like to your travels here than what you... Changes quick, the lighting. Isn't there? Have you and Professor Fig not discussed my training? 
He continues to be reticent about the details, mentioning only a few spells. Revelio, was it? And Lumos? Yep, that's correct, Professor. That's it. See. <laughs> like trying to get a sonnet from a streamer. Regardless, you must continue to build upon what you do. I do not know what that phrase meant. A sonnet from a stealer? It's gotta be very British. Extra. Professor Ronan did mention something about that. In fact, Professor Ronan will meet you outside momentarily to assign your first one. Sweet. Now, regarding the trip to Hogsmeade I mentioned earlier, we've arranged to replace the supplies lost on your way here, including seeds, potion recipes, and spell crafts. Thank you, Professor. And Mr. Ollivander will connect you with the perfect <coughs> wand. You've managed Ooh. your classes well with a borrowed wand, but you'll find the magic you cast with your own wand to be far superior. Yeah, I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. We've played already, anyway, so I don't think we need those questions. I'd like you to make your first visit to the village with a classmate. Help you get your bearings. I'm gonna do Natty. Thanks, Last time I did. Last time I did, Sebastian. I'm gonna do I'm Natty this time. Spending time with them. Let's do Natty. I'd like to go with Natty. Excellent choice. Miss Odai is one of our most talented students. And she knows the area. She'll keep you well clear of any of Victor Rookwood's undesirables en route. Rookwood? A rather unsavory local. Best to avoid him and his associates, including his right hand of sorts, <laughs> Theophilus Harlow, if you can. Sweet. Once you've finished Professor Ronan's assignment, your friend will meet you at the castle. I was choked on a Swedish fish. The sooner you complete your work, the sooner you I almost died on a candy. Alright. Let's do it. Let me know if you're going live tonight, dude. I would definitely check it out. Reparo. We can't do that one yet because we got to do Reparo. All right, so let's do that one first. We want to get going to where we can freely explore. His cat. Give the cat my love. Ah, there you are. You have a new spell to teach me, Professor. Indeed I do. And an exceedingly useful one at that. The mending charm, Reparo. Fixes Literally almost right died. Makes a broken object good as new in the blink of an eye. <laughs> it seems as if that might come in handy. More frequently than one would imagine. As Professor Weasley mentioned, I am not the only one who will be teaching you spells outside of class in an effort to catch you up with your peers. A number of your professors have nice. agreed to do so as well. But first, each shall ask that you complete a few preliminary tasks to hone your magic. I have arranged some for today. See them through and then report back to me. <laughs> we will have you uh, casting Reparo nice. in no time. I'll start on the task right away, Professor. All right. Revelio. I didn't get that. Accio. Nice. This is the All right. Got it. Wait, what am I supposed to do? Oh. Collect the flying pages first. I was like, what? Oh, look right there. page must be around here somewhere. Brilliant. Get two pages, run right back. Alright, bro, bro. I done it. I trust the preliminary. I completed the assignments, Professor. Marvelous. You clearly know your way around basic charms. Let us give the old mending charm a try then. We shall. shall. We? Remember to be deliberate in your Diagonally. pronunciation and movements. I want to see some vigor. Now, wand at the ready. Diagonally. Remember, your wand Ooh. is a conduit of your magic. All right. 
five people in here, man. That is dope. Appreciate you guys coming in. That's it. Very good. If you would like to practice mending something, have Apparel. a go with that broken statue in the alcove by the wall. It allegedly symbolized heartbreak. Perhaps a jilted lover. Rebellion. Nice. All right, we're on our way. We're almost five. That it? Oh, 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 where's that one at? It's in here. Is it? Rebellious. Collecting these field guys fast. Where is that? Maybe it's not. That definitely looks like it's inside. Maybe it's at the roof. Maybe I gotta like point at the roof. There's only one common one. There it is. <laughs> Don't burn it up. Another one. Level five. All right. That's kind of where we wanted to be. Welcome to Hogsmeade. Ready? Let's do cross wands, and then we'll do Hogsmeade. And we will start getting on our way here. Once we get to Hogsmeade, I'm fairly confident. If only a new student would help me with my sad yeah. predicament. Are you alright? Don't you know who I am? Zenobia Noak. The girl who everyone yet. at school hates for no reason. <laughs> everyone hates you. Why? Because Hogwarts oh. is full of bullies and spoil sports. Leander Pruitt's one of the worst. Wow. That no talent moon mind. <laughs> I wanted to make some new friends, and so I brought my collection down to the common room. My gobstone collection, that is. I was hoping Good someone there? would want to play. Not really. Are you familiar with gobstones? Little balls, like marbles. Ground game. And if you lose, Why would they you spray want to do that? you with a foul smelling liquid. Gobstones? Sounds like a fun challenge. Why would you want to do that? I tried to tell everyone. <sighs> People can be so cruel. Just because they're sprayed all over with smelly gobstone spit. It's their own fault for losing. Oh, yeah. There is one of the worst losers. Everett and Astoria are terrible as well. And now those poor losers have taken my gobstones and hidden them in very oh. high places all over the school. Oh, they're just annoyed. I don't know. I'll say. Anyway, I can't work out how to get them back on my own. I don't think I know the necessary spells yet. I need someone, perhaps a self Sounds like manipulation. Fifth year to help me. <laughs> I'll see what I can do. I'd appreciate the help. If you do find all of my we'll do, we'll do. Stones, do come and see me again. I'll be back to playing Snake Pit and Jackstone by myself in no time. <laughs> Let me know if you tune in, bro. My brother might tune in. Nah, we'll do that one later. I don't really want to do that one right now. This way? Same much go this way. There we go. Oop. Rebellion. Alright. 
make it. Lucan's just over there. Let me know. Alright. Yeah. Can I help you? Sebastian told me to see you about a club. If Sebastian vouches for you, that's all I need to know. Sick. I coordinated duels across Swans. A dueling club of sorts. It's invitation only, so you Not must so. have really impressed Sebastian. I'm flattered to hear that. Sebastian's not a bad duelist either. Imagine it's quite something to see the two of you duel. How does Cross Wands work exactly? You show up, I match you with other duelists, and whoever assists nice. them in the end wins. It's our way of determining the school's greatest duelist once and for all. And to liven things up, the winner is awarded a Definitely. prize. Interested? Of course. Dueling's an entertaining pastime. I agree. Besides, in cross bonds, you could duel with a partner if you like. Your first time I'll pair you with Sebastian. Next time, you'll need to bring a partner along or duel alone. Let's do it. Care to step into the ring? Get me in the ring. I literally have no spells right now, so we'll see how this goes. Okay. And when you're like, you should have taken it easy on me. A lot quicker this one, aren't I? Ah. Definitely need more. Definitely need more spells. I need ones that can actually cause damage, cause nice work. that was all wasn't wrong about basic you. cast stuff There's right there. Competition ahead, but keep this up and that was all basic cast. Champion. Brilliant. Count me in. I shall. Now it takes time to organize these duels, but check with me later. Sick. I may have something lined up for you. Again, congratulations on your first cross one victory. Well Thank fought. you, sir. Thank you, sir. Let's see you back here again. Okay. Nice. Hmm. There it is. To wait for that one. Rebellion. All right. So I should probably go ahead and do. The Hogsmeade one. And that will teach me the ancient magic throw. Ooh, look at all these side quests. Alright, sweet. And I know so much more about the map, too, which is nice. And, like, how to find the side quests. Earlier, like, hey, I don't know, how do I know if I have side quests and all that kind of stuff? And now I actually know, and it's nice. All right, we'll go there. Cut down some time. Cut down some time. <laughs> what? That was it. Half a bottle of flabbergasted leech, stirred clockwise. All right. 
Me and Natty. Off on another adventure, are we? Rebellion. Yeah, that's something I definitely need to do more of too. <laughs> Welcome in. Oh. That's going to be on the other side of this. Something else in here. Rebellion. I am, but I'm also collecting these things. Hello, looking for me? Ow. My foot. Natty, I hope I haven't kept you waiting long. Not at all. Professor Weasley tells me that you need to go to Hogsmeade. You must be eager to have your own things again. And to see the village. I've been looking forward to it. Natty. Great. Shall we set off? I intend to give you a first rate Natty. <sighs> Naughty Natty. Naughty Natty. Let's see what she shows me. We're free! Finally outside. Alright. I was glad Professor Weasley asked me to accompany you. Really? Oh, yes, thanks, Nats. I had planned to extend an invitation to you myself. I thought you might enjoy a better be in the village. <laughs> the timing there of Professor go. Weasley's hour was perfect. I cannot tell you how nice it is to breathe fresh air <laughs> after being cooped up in ancient ruins. Grave mistake to take it as an elective class, believe me. I believe you. Though I suppose you would not really call it elective when your mother was the one who elected that you take it. Hogsmeade is beautiful this time of year. Everyone will tell you to visit at Christmas. But that's one of the few times of year I Yeah, I feel like you don't need choice. to change the voice. But when you change the voice, the gold, are you? Has this especially uh, deeper? It has like this weird echo so quality much, to it. But it has taken some getting used so to. they just layered it over but deeper. Up around snow. Oh, wait, over here. I often spot Rebellion. the flags in this area. Oh? What's so special about them? They are interesting to look at. But if you stew them, you can also use them in potions. Yeah, we're definitely still in the introduction, introductory phase of this relationship. Right? Look, from a forbidden forest. I, sh I should have left it normal. I wonder if something startled them. I heard rumors that hippogriffs had been spotted nearby. Like I, yeah. I definitely, because I'm definitely hearing it. And I'm like, eh. Absolutely. Yeah. Go there so quick. Yeah, you can hear it, right? Off limits to students, as the name implies. Why is it off limits? The professors claim it is too dangerous. I think I call it forbidden. Where'd she go? More alluring. Welcome in. Welcome in. Over the crest, past that ruin. Going get this. I would spend all of my time exploring if I could. I confess, I was surprised when Professor Weasley mentioned that you knew the area, since you're relatively. We've new. seen death. She said that. We've seen death. She knows more about me than I had thought. I will say, while I certainly learned. You know, it's still unclear to me. 
Much can be gleaned outside of the country. How they found me. Like, how did Fig find me and realize that I had this potential and power? Because none of that's really explained. It's, it's like, I'm just kind of like... I'm just kind of like on the way to Hogwarts. How are you settling in? But it's not like they're like, the oh, my arrival, something yeah. happened and you stopped a fire or something. Like so. You know what I mean? And unfamiliar. How did I become just you? You find you feel settled? ready to do this? But it is beautiful here too. And getting out of the castle and exploring Oop. helped me to adjust quite a bit. Hogwarts has become What's something over? of a home now. And Puff schemes. It will for you too. Sorry, I had to check. One second now. Here's the Hogwarts caretaker. Looks a bit worse for wear. Hello, Mr. Moon. Have you met our new fifth year? Pleasure. Um, you might want to turn back, Miss On I. Uh, turn and run. Is everything all right, sir? Uh, oh, it looked right at me. Eyes big as saucers. <laughs> what did Mr. Moon? Jemmy guys. Dougly and Arian. Terrifying. All right. I shall be at the castle where it's safe. Oh. Good luck to both of you. Poor Mr. Moon. <gasps> a demigod. I think he had too much fun in the Go village. ahead and get my moonstone I going. I say that I have never seen him in such a state. <laughs> Nearly there. There is much to see outside of the castle walls, not just Hogsmeade. I am happy to explore whenever you'd like. Rumors being what they are about goblins and such. Bam, hug me. Sam, what's up, bro? Ah, got another one. It's impossible to know where to start. And here we are. It is hard to know where to start. So, the All-Star Game. is the place for butterbeer. And you can get any sweet you can imagine at Honey Bee. The reason why... I could not choose a favorite It shop. was so disliked. Was because of the lack of... Really, any type of defense. Just hard to sit through. Which, I know, I know you don't like Nick Wright. But he had a very good... Um, Professor Very good show. To get potion recipes, on uh, crafts, some seeds, and first, first things first course, about it. You will enjoy Mr. Oliver. Pretty much the idea was that we put so much analysis on championships, on postseason success, that everybody just try to save themselves. I know, I know that you're not, you're not big on Nick, but. Pretty much he was just saying that because, um, yep, 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 nice. He's pretty much just saying that, uh, because we put so much emphasis on the postseason, that it's like, why would I try in the All-Star game? You know, the All-Star game is now just, it's just a thing. It's, it's not important, you know. Somebody, one person will usually try to win All-Star game MVP. It'll be like a younger guy. Who's first time there? But for the most part, you know what I mean. An inquiring mind. Why try? That's why. You know, Giannis played a couple minutes. LeBron. You know, until until he knows it's his last season, he's not gonna try to win MVP. He's gonna chill. Russ won a couple years ago, really trying hard to get it. I'm afraid. Yeah, Tatum said the. But again, I think they. Every year they keep it setting a points record, and that's purest, because every year it becomes less and less of, course it of even a game. It's just kind of like everybody get on the court, my everybody just get on the court, the course, try to get as many dunks and threes. They said 94% of all the shots were either a three-point shot or an open to layup or dunk. 94% of the shots. So it's like... Not even Spare trying at that point. Useful for conjuring unique items like custom pieces of furniture. It's not my lookalike. I, I made him but Gary Trotter. Do the for now, so this is my second playthrough in Gryffindor. 
It's on. I turned the difficulty out. Yes, I believe so, sir. Good. Yeah, Nothing I turned like turn the difficulty up, and uh, this is Gary Trotter. What you want, when you want. Let's you free? Look. Nice. Let's look at what we have, shall we? We have 113 cent. No, we have no reason to, but we can't buy anything. <laughs> Feel free to take a look we literally can't buy nothing right now. Right. So next. Yeah, so... Uh, the reason I'm gonna do this one now is because my girl's gonna do Hufflepuff. She wants to do Hufflepuff because she wants to be able to go to Azkaban. I'm like, okay, I guess I'll just watch you go to Azkaban now. Yeah. Let me go back here. Rebellion. I know there's something we're supposed to do in here, right? to get uh I wanted to do Hufflepuff too but she just uh it's like that's you bought it for me you bought it for me yes sir yes sir <laughs> Yep. Pretty much, bro, bro. It's a three or it's a wide open dunk. And that's... That's what it is now. That It just is what it is, dude. It is what it is right now. There's nothing wrong with that, but it's just like... You know what I mean? Like, It's almost like there needs to be... Just don't play an all-star game. You know what I mean? If it's absolutely no defense and there's no point, what are we doing? Like, why are we, why are we even out there pretending like it's a thing? You know what I mean? Just uh, have these dudes kind of hang out, do some dunks, or play like three on three, like a little a little three on three tournament. You know, you got to get creative because there's just not going to be any defense played. Don't sit there and pretend to play a regular game. Just a moment, please. And we sit there playing no defense, nothing. And we get to the end of the game, we're like, oh, all right, well, we wasted our time. Uh, they're not cheap. I mean, an all-star weekend is like a thing. Like... All the professional thotty yaddy yaddies fly into whatever city. It's kind of like that yacht trip to Miami. You know what I mean? It's got that kind of energy to it. The MVP is on the floor and the MVP is off the floor. All fly into the same city. So, we'll see. Like... Last year it was in Cleveland, this year it was in Utah, next year it's in Indiana, and then I think it comes back to LA. But they've been uh, a lot of people have been very unhappy with the with the All Star City of the past couple of years. Mainly because look, if you're from Atlanta, Houston, Vegas, Chris and Rob were saying they've seen players play harder in the summer league. Yes, exactly. Like, we'll find you something not to worry. If, if you're playing uh, you, uh, harder in the offseason than you are in the All-Star game, perhaps, what's the point? They're yes. not going to Jacksonville. Not a chance. Wood, but, inches, dragon no, they, um, Let's give this one a try. they gotta do something with it. I Just do, just do a three-on-three -three tournament. Just do a 3v3 tournament, half court. Something different because Looks like it's back to the shelf for you. there's no point. Like it, there used to be more defense. This is proving to be to where the final scores are like 120. Dude, at halftime they were at like 80 points, 80, 80 to 90 or something like that. I was like, I'm not watching that. There's no point to watch that. I'd rather watch the Daytona 500 than that. So 
And LeBron had a nice dunk off the backboard, and Jason Tatum threw one off the backboard. And yeah. There was some stuff going on, but you know what I mean? As far as, like, I went with that last time, natural gray. We're going to go with rain. We're going to go with poplar. How intriguing. Curious indeed. Quite bendy. How intriguing. I think we want what did we want again? I know we want that. Ah, Phoenix Feather. Exceptionally rare, and a core with a strong sense of initiative. Quite bendy. Curious indeed. Swishy. That's too hard. How intriguing. The big three clippers, Revenge of Westbrook. Yeah, so, and I was watching, um, they were talking about how he wasn't going to come, uh, how he wasn't going to come off the bench, right? And then it got released today that he's going to start. So, I don't, I just don't know. I don't know how that works how out. Intriguing. I guess you hope for the best. I don't know. Oh, that ain't gonna happen. Curious go with that. Go with that. What do you think? But I just, we'll see. I just know that, uh, you know, it didn't work with the Lakers. He's been on, I don't know, six teams in five years, so we'll see. There's 20 games left, and they're trying to work in a starting point guard with Russ's ability. Let's see how that all works out. I'm not sure. I think Russ fans are blaming the Lakers. Lakers fans are blaming Russ. We'll see what works out. I don't know. Of course. And a phoenix feather core is terribly yeah. effective. This will be an excellent match indeed. I don't and know. I'm still. You and your wand should only grow stronger. Do not I've never seen the Clippers healthy. ability to perceive your intentions. And the whole time Kawhi's been there, particularly except for that one time in the bubble. Need. That sounds wonderful, Mr. Ollivander. I'll let you get. And we knew what happened in that bubble. Come and see me again. I won't do it again. I can be of further assistance. We won't talk about the bubble anymore, but. You already know what happened in that bubble. They didn't want to be there. They didn't want to be there. They flew all the way to the bubble when they didn't want to be there. Rebellion. Lemon Pepper Lou. They didn't want to be there, but they showed up anyway. We'll see. Hey, I will believe it when I see it. It was more of a chance of AD being healthy. That's crazy to say. Welcome to AD has a higher chance of being healthy. You saw that video I sent you earlier. Pardon me, sir. 
Oh, thank goodness. That video I sent you well, earlier. You they, soccer player kicking the ball well, in the kid's head. First here. comment. Though, 80 got hurt watching this. I started rolling. Before, either. It's my started rolling. Husband, actually. Is it really? Well, he had some help. The Zebras gave him some help when he needed it. He's the new Brady, so as soon as... All of a sudden, those flags start coming out. Slowly march him down the field. All of a sudden, the laundry starts hitting the field. I set your things aside immediately. I suspected if you're anything like I was at your age... You'd want your potion supplies. It's funny because I was watching um, the, most fascinating art potion making? the uh the new XFL. I'm watching it, bro. They they even have they have the replay booth mic'd up. The NFL would nah. just as powerful. They can heal replay booth? Nah. They ain't doing that. As it's your first time in they for sure are not doing that. They want. They do I not want us knowing what they're talking about. For all of uses. And I unveil new we will never hear what, what they're talking about. Pop in when you can, so you don't uh, miss out on anything. Hmm? But for now, let's get you those recipes, shall we? The XFL was like, "Yeah, come on in. We'll, we'll show you how we make the decisions." And I was like, "Nah, I'll make that in a private back room in New York. Feel free I'll let them know nothing." Come back another right. time if you're in a rush today. All right. Rebellion. Looking good. Uh oh no the I mean less brutal is not a thing. There's there is no safe way to play football. It's impossible. You cannot play football safe. The second you try to play safe, you get hurt. It's just not a safe game. There's no way to play. I will say there are certain things that are safer. Like, uh, for instance, I saw the kickoff. There's almost no kick kickoff or kick return. It's like, it's very much like we line up, we barely kick it. Because <laughs> they're trying to reduce injuries, especially on kickoffs and special teams. You can tell that they're making like a con uh, concentrated effort to make sure that people do not get hurt on kickoffs, which is not a bad thing. Like that's smart. You don't want to injure people. Literally in a in what I would consider a farm league. Like they're the XFL is going to be the farm league for the NFL. They're going to try new rules out. They're going to try, you know, all the stuff that they would do. Um, T.O. is about to join one of the teams. Uh, he could. He definitely could. I mean, my opinion is that uh, T.O. could play in. <laughs> T.O. could definitely play in the XFL. He's. I don't think he could play in the NFL still. But I think he's, he'd be good enough to play in the XFL Rebellion. for sure. Because a lot of those guys are like guys who most of them won't make it to the NFL. But they are trying to. They're trying to. They're trying to get there. You know what I mean? On their way. And we'll see. I'm sure somebody will. So one person usually always makes it. There'll be one person, like a a he hate me type. I don't know if you remember that story or, or at all. Uh, so essentially, XFL, yes, exactly. And I think that's where he got the idea from. I think he was like, you know, Vince had the idea that you could compete with the NFL. Right? And although I don't Rebellion. disagree that you can compete with them, they have such a head start. We, nah, we got her playing basketball. We not going, we not doing that. But the NFL has such a head start that I, I don't think, unless you literally had, like, so, I'll compare it to the PGA because the PGA now has 
uh, a competition in something called Live Golf, L I V, Live Golf Tournament or whatever. So they had some Saudi backed investors. So some dudes in Saudi Arabia had been talking to like some ex professional players on the golf tournament and realized that the payouts were just like really low. So then they had the idea of like, well, if you can get enough golfers to jump ship, you can make a tournament. And you can pretty much play a whole tournament with enough golfers to where people will watch both, right? Eventually they'll get TV deals and stuff like this. Well, hello there. Pardon yeah. Me, sir. I the seeds Professor Weasley arranged for me to collect. He wastes a lot of money on it. I think The Rock helped him out, though, because he you, bought it at a uh, discount, but he got some of the money back. So it's not a total loss, but it's still a pretty big loss. I think The Rock understood. The NFL has such a head start that unless you had billions of dollars in investment, I mean, you're just not going to catch up. You have to, you have to poach all the quarterbacks. The only way that you can compete with the NFL would literally be to get Patrick Mahomes, to get Aaron Rodgers, to get all of those top elite quarterbacks to come over. That's the only way. Because if you take all the quarterbacks, nothing you can do. And they did it a long time ago. Uh, with her, uh, I think it was Herschel Walker years and years and years ago, right? Do have a look around. Plenty of ingredients to pique your interest, don't we? So they did it years and years ago. I know there's one over here, cause well, that's everything. I missed this one last time, Matty. right? And um, yeah, there it is. Um, Rebellion. I think they did it with Herschel Walker. And they gave him the biggest contract in history. And the problem is they only got Herschel Walker, right? So if you're watching the NFL who has all these stars and then this other league only has Herschel Walker, it's going to be very hard to compete. But Rebellion. if you get Patrick Mahomes and you get... Which, you know what Patrick Mahomes' contract is, right? So in order to get him, you've got to spend... Probably a billion dollars just to get Patrick Mahomes because literally uh, <laughs> he has a $450 million contract with the NFL. So the only way that you're going to convince him to leave the NFL, whose prestige is like next level, is to give him a billion dollars. Well, if you give Patrick Mahomes a billion dollars, you're going to have to make all that money back really quick. I think the issue is that... The, that before you can even get that off the ground, it's gonna go bankrupt. So I just don't, I just don't see how you compete with them on that level. Now, if you create the XFL as a training ground for the NFL, you see, you see what it means. You can create a training ground for them, and then you have them help finance it. And that way, you, it's kind of what the, the NBA does for the WNBA. The WNBA doesn't have to make money because the NBA will always finance it and keep it afloat. And so if you do the same thing with the XFL and the NFL and you make it a breeding ground for NFL players, you know, let's say you go to college, you graduate, you don't get a... You don't get a shot, you come, you, you ball out in the uh, XFL, and then you get a tryout. I think that is the idea behind it. It's, you know? Nice. Oh, we're getting these pages. Now it's, I just think it's smarter. It's definitely the smarter way to go about it. To try to, you know what I mean, get that money. You definitely want to, you know, use what you can use to get that money. Because if not, 
You you will always be <laughs> all I had was seven dollars in my pocket and a tryout and a family name that spanned back thirty, forty years in wrestling. But that's it, that's all I had. And Vin Diesel on the fine. Vin Diesel on the hotline. But that's all I had. <laughs> um but the difference, like I was talking to you about PGA, the difference is PGA Tour and Live Golf, they got some Saudi billionaires to back a tournament, and then instead of like the PGA Tour members only getting 1.2 million, 2 million if they win, they get like 10, 15 million if they win one tournament and Live Golf. So, there'll be golfers, like the 40 or 50th ranked golfer and their and their career in the BJ Tour, and that's with winning like two or three tournaments. Their career total is they've made 15 million. Then they can win one tournament and live golf and make 15 million. That's like why would I be on the PGA Tour? But that's because it's it's all individual. You know what I mean, you only have to get individual golfers to come. The NFL has a 53 man roster, so it's much more difficult. Ooh. Right. I'm like stuck. I was trying to beat him as a I die. Took him long enough. <laughs> I pulled him towards me. Wanna go? <sighs> Bye. Goodness. I think so. A second troll. Did you two take on a fully grown troll? I just can't believe By Vince thought that was a good plan. I suppose so. I really cannot believe you thought that was a good plan. Merlin's beard. That's and crazy to me. We are. We were glad Cuz he's only one he's only one billionaire like he would have had to get literally 30 like that. 30 to 40 so other billionaires on me. on the same if idea. Are unharmed. Perhaps the two of you wouldn't mind helping me put a few things back to where they were. Of course, officer. Singer. Officer Singer, and thank you again. Rafaro.
put it all back together. Lucky they didn't think they got that shit. It would be. I will say if the Clipper if the Clippers do win though, back onto that Clippers thing. Man, if they were to win. That would do great things. For uh, a lot of people's legacies, especially Russ. You think about if, if Russ and Kawhi and Paul George actually got that done, that would help them tremendously. Baby girl, will that happen? The Clippers. It would hurt LeBron. But it would definitely, uh, I don't believe it would that. definitely help Kawhi, Paul George, and Russ, especially Russ. He'd get to be like, "See, it wasn't me. It wasn't me." Apparently, they're saying that they might try to trade AD for Kyrie, like a sign and trade next year. Interesting. I own glad rags, wizard wear, and among my inventory are some unique items that afford certain protections, as it were. Life saving protections. I don't know about this won't be your last dangerous encounter. I'd like to give you one such set of robes. In fact, for what you the least I can do. Thank you, Mr. Hill. That's very <sighs> generous of you. It's the least I can do. Uh, Think about that. Let's try this on for size, shall we? Plenty for your perusal mm. today. Take your time. <sighs> I just... That's what they're saying. They're saying that, that would be the perfect... Um... The perfect pairing for him. I don't know. Like... I just think like wouldn't Luca like if Luca's what been watching like the last three to four years need. with the and Lakers why would he want a guy who's never there when you need him better. like you know Should I would rather get get a guy that like is gonna be there just down this way, you know what I mean I sell even more go get <laughs> and, like, not that they wouldn't work cause like I don't think that's ever going to happen. I don't think that's going to happen. But, you know, if you're... If you, um... Yeah, let's do this. If you're, um... Luca, and you want a big guy that can kind of shoot... And, there's other guys. There's other, if I was him, I'd try to get with Joker. Because Joker's healthy. And Joker can pass. He doesn't have to score. He doesn't need the ball. You know what I mean? You can make that work. Ooh, going crazy. But AD, I've been I've been saying the Lakers should trade AD anyway. So you said you could get to the. I just don't think you're gonna. You're not gonna get. And if you're the Lakers, why would you try to do a sign and trade with Kyrie for AD? I just watched a student take down your distraction. You traded Ingram, Hart, Who's this child? What are you not telling me? and a whole bunch of other people All for AD and, the, is, and picks. I don't know. Then you have no value to me. Seems like you need to get more than just Kyrie back. <laughs> Let's go. I don't know. When you can just get Kyrie anyway. Like, if there's any time that LeBron should take a pay cut, I don't think so. now, take a pay cut, get Kyrie, trade AD for John Collins or something, John Collins and some players from, it, from the Hawks. I knew I'd seen him somewhere. Quickly, let's get inside the three throne sticks. What do I know? I'm just a guy. It's a treat to see you, Lord Gok. I shall let you know if I hear anything. Thank you, Serona. I'm just a guy on a computer playing a video game. But discount Rob Lowe. I mean, he made 
He made some good moves. He made some good moves at the yeah, trade deadline. I... They got a lot better oh. than what they were. There's a face I haven't seen before. So we'll see. <laughs> it's my first time here. Welcome. Butterbeer's on me. Clay, Clay with a K. It's a K. You're a Warriors fan, so you better know that. It's Clay with a K. But Clay, I could see gone. Steph ain't going nowhere. Steph is never going to play for another organization. Thanks for this. I can promise you that. I will say. Never. Never ever. Never ever. Never ever. Not a chance he ever goes anywhere. The only brutes we usually have to deal with. You better get your boy's name right. But was that Lodgok I saw leaving just now? I just don't. Uh, Your clientele's not what it used to be, Serena. Not Steph. Worry, but, uh, Steph knows where his bread is buttered. The caliber of my clientele. And he could literally miss the playoffs ten years in a row at this point. And Warriors cow. fans would be like, "Yeah, well, you know, he's getting older. No need for theatrics. He's gonna get to that Kobe phase." I'm okay. Oh, this stop way, it. Anyway. My friend is stop it. He doesn't claim Akron. He claims North Carolina. You know this. You and I know. You and I know. You know what I know. You know what I know. My friend is busy. One would think you all had enough bloodshed for one day. Come to your honest. The three broomsticks isn't what it used to be. Let's take our galleons elsewhere. I'll drink butter beer forever. Seems you've made an unfortunate enemy. Watch your back. Rookwood and Harlow are worse than any troll you might encounter. Trolls, Ranrock, and Rookwood. What are you not telling me? I promise to tell you everything. But it's perhaps best I do that later. Heading back to the castle. I think that now we need to learn more spells. Because what I got ain't. It's gonna be sad, dude. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do when LeBron retires, man? Like, where's all your hate gonna go? Where's all that hate gonna go, Sam? Because I'm you like, you have hated this guy for so she isn't long. Intimidated by thugs like and where's Hall? that gonna go, man? I want to understand what's going on. I don't know. And I hope you will tell me. You're gonna have to find someone new to hate. Professor Weasley will certainly hear about the You're gonna have to find someone new to hate, bro. I don't want her to and, worry. Uh, I don't know if you're ready. I don't know if you're ready for that. Are you ready for the day? <laughs> I rest. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Ladies and gentlemen, the real diabolical hater. Forget Skip Bayless. I'll have Al Horford. Oh, jeez. You love Al. <laughs> Al's your boy. He's always done right by you. <laughs> uh, not Al Horford. Um, well, oop, I think it crashed on me, didn't it? Oh, it crashed on me. We'll have to load back in as Gary Trotter. Lovely. We started level one today, so we already got seven levels up. It obviously gets way harder as we go, though. It obviously gets way harder. I don't know what happened there. All of a sudden, it just decided it didn't want to work anymore, huh? 
We're done. Maybe it's because I haven't actually gotten that flu flame yet. I'm not sure there, but all of a sudden it decided, nah, we not working today. <laughs> all right, there we go. So we got through that. Bam. All right, we're on our way. We haven't unlocked our talents yet. Rob and Chris opened my eyes to a lot of basketball stuff you didn't even mention. They're very objective and open. With Undisputed, I'm watching the LeBron Fan Club. Well, you're watching, too. You're watching the LeBron Fan Club and the LeBron Hate Club. So you're actually watching both on Undisputed. First things first, I, will, I actually enjoy first things first more now. Just because there's a, there's a little bit better camaraderie too, like maybe maybe Skip and Shannon don't like each other anymore. I don't know. It just seems like now. I don't know. I, I seem to like. Uh, I seem to like it better. To me, it just like. Come see me. The locket we found at Green Guts. I've discovered something. It just feels like. Uh, you know what I mean? The camaraderie is a little better. You get a little bit more of the, um, about, about a lot of different topics. You know, you still have Nick Wright, which I know you love, but, um, yeah, it just, it just seems like the show flows a little bit better, especially like when you, um, When you talk about uh, Nick and Chris, Undisputed, it's just Shannon and um, Skip in one room. The moderator is like off to the side now. Yeah, but the moderator is not even on the stage anymore. She's not even present. She's just like kind of when they did the live shows at the Super Bowl, that was the best the show has been in a long time. I just don't like the show without the. What's she doing? What's she doing? Crazy ass. Uh, I don't like the show as much without the moderator present. Bro, Jenny ain't never coming back. She is so over Skip Bayless. Like, if they if they had a, had succeeded in canceling Skip Bayless. Uh, Jenny would have celebrated, I can promise you. Rebellion. Jenny would have been like, thank God it's over. Jenny ain't coming back, bro, bro. Never, ever, never, ever, ever, ever. Never happened. So, <laughs> it will never happen, bro. You know, I just, I like the fact that you got, and they don't even have a moderator on that show. It's just the three of them, and they just introduce the topics themselves. They've taken out the moderator, and they just do the topics Daddy. themselves. One of them, I'm going to keep beating that drum, Shannon. And they just bring up the topics themselves, and it's like organic, and I like it. Whereas when I watch Undisputed, you know, uh, Jen Hale's off to the side. Sometimes she gets to, even even sometimes when she introduces the show, She'll introduce the show, but then, like, immediately they cut her off, and she's just, like, she's just sitting on camera awkwardly, like, all right, guys, well, let's get to the first topic, as you guys were alluding to, um, Dak Prescott and the Cowboy, you know what I mean? It's just kind of awkward. So, I think I like, uh, I think I'd rather watch, if I had to, I'd rather watch First Things First. Of course, I think it's on, is it on before Undisputed? Hopefully it's after because that Undisputed comes on at like 6 a.m. out here. So it would be very hard to get up at 3, 4 in the morning to watch First Things First. So hopefully it's after. But I just kind of, I just kind of like it better. Just at this point. And mainly because 
as LeBron is not. I only watched first take for Stephen A. and Swag. Oh, and Molly. <laughs> not the biggest shader. Yeah, he gets. He just gets so emotional, and I, I hate the fake walking off set. I know I don't care about the fake walking off. He walked off set. Who cares? Bye, bye. It's an opinion. Walk off set. No one cares. I'm not a fan of that. The constantly walking off set. You. Uh, Professor. Okay. I'm glad to see you. Cool. And I you. Thank Merlin you're in one piece. I heard about yeah, the I, attack. Trolls I still think me? that Sir, nothing will ever on. rival Skip and Stephen A. Like, like in their heyday on first take. Ran I don't think anything will, will rival that. And I'm sh and I'm sure they they'll sit there and, and say the ratings are better for this show, that show. The ratings are better than they've ever been, but that's that's really when the show was at its like peak and prime with Skip and Skip and uh, Stephen A. This is great news indeed. Box office. I'm not saying the brother can't play. I'm not saying. I'm not saying that he shouldn't shoot free throws. I'm not saying he shouldn't be an all star. Yes. yes. I discovered an inscription when I read it aloud. This map appears. The brother is box office. That being said, he should be traded immediately. To be sure. But I do not know where it lives. I know a close personal friend of his. A restricted <laughs> section, to be precise. I know a close personal friend of the family who says he is done with Toronto. I suspected you would see something. Should we go? I appreciate your enthusiasm, and I'm eager to discover what we may find there as well. But if our experience at Grindrops... I like Shannon a lot, though. Miriam ...taught me anything. It's that the There's path a thing we're on is I know his dangerous. mother personally. I'd like to work with Professor Heckett a bit before we continue. <laughs> but sir, how dangerous could the library be? But perhaps we're only after a book. Perhaps we are only after I do a think book, that but Skip we be prepared for anything. Once you Stephen A were a little better than Skip and Shannon. Come and see like me. on the on the full I'll picture. Let Professor Heckett know to expect you. I don't know. I like I like Shannon a lot. You know I'm a big Shannon fan. The same. Hey. Incendio finally. Finally we're learning some stuff. But there de definitely was something to um to skip and Shannon. Or skip and Stephen A. It was just real I mean that show was so good. And I thought, I thought Skip was crazy leaving, like, because it's not like, um, I hadn't seen Fox Sports, I, I knew Fox Sports existed, but I never watched it. And I never watched it because they really just didn't have enough content, which is maybe what the plan was. They just knew that until they got their own debate show and like ESPN has so many the jump uh, NFL uh, NFL live I think it's called uh, with Berman Tom Jackson uh, then they have you know around the horn pardon the interruption I still think they have the better shows Rebellion. because there's so much that they have that Fox Sports does Fox Sports has Undisputed, uh, and then it has First First Things First. I think it has a NASCAR show. I don't know. It has an MMA show, too. I just don't know if it has enough content you wanted to teach me like ESPN that. does. Good. A professor so many. A or they do, and I just have no idea about them. Your defensive just no idea at all. As such, you are so. to learn Incendio, the fire-making spell, handy for lighting torches. Burning away spider webs, and when necessary, defend against those who would wish to do Always us the harm. task. Sounds versatile. Quite. But before we get started, I'd like you to complete a few tasks. You may be surprised by nice, some of let's them. Do it. Astonishing how much students Always don't task. think their professors know. When you're finished, 
Come and see me. All right. Then we shall begin working on incendio. Two rounds of cross wands, so we gotta go ahead and do that. You know where to find me once you've finished. Which we can do that pretty easy, and then complete a round of spell practice. So we should already be able to fast travel there. Seems cool. Hi, baby. Ooh, you're crazy. Ooh. You're a crazy girl today. As it's believed. You was running around insane, wasn't you? Oh, here we go. I'm bad. Did you, um, Hello, did you watch the latest WWE the event? Ones all set? Why, yes it is. I've got a great match lined up. Ready for another round? Don't I'm know ready. if you watched the, uh, Brilliant. Sammy oh, Roman. Yes, Natty. Then let's get to it. I have, like, no... Ready to get thrashed? No good spells right now. Apologies in advance. Oh man. You got me? There we go. Man. That one took a while. Hey, baby. Ah. You just watch him, Papa. Ah. <sighs> Bravo. I gave it my all. You did indeed. The other duelists have already taken notice of you. But after that ah. last round. They'll really have it in Hi, for you. Baby. You'd better keep practicing if you want a chance of winning. Or at least surviving yeah, right. the next round. That's I'll done. let you know when we're ready. Hope to see you then. Go ahead, go ahead. Cry about it. I know you gonna cry. The next round is for all the gobstones, so to speak. Ah, oh, Brad. Should have been talking. Seems I'm out of the tournament thanks to you. Perhaps I should have been talking. Hello, Lucan. 
May I use the training dummy? Of course. I'll fetch it and give you a list of combinations for practice. Ready to have a try now? That would be wonderful. Be sure to cast all your spells before the dummy lands. If you need to stop practicing before you finish all of them, let me know. Bam! Thanks. He is a pro. Good one. He's a pro. You looked good out there. Thank you, Lucan. I say better nice. to discover weaknesses during practice than during Now we can actually go learn what we need to learn. Challenger now. What's up, baby? Side quest. Assignment's all finished. Got eight. We're starting. We're doing it. Maybe it hasn't loaded up yet. Maybe it hasn't loaded up yet. Oh, I'm not sure yet. <clears throat> what are you up to now, Rebellio? It's definitely rolling way more than we did on normal. You can definitely tell that the difficulty is is going to be more difficult, especially when we get to the end. Like you get way less of a counter while fighting, that's for sure. So we're gonna have to get these spells and get these upgrades, get the loom, get all that stuff. Because without it. Without it, it's gonna be a struggle. Should be. I trust Mr. Brattleby was able to. I finished all of the tasks you gave me, Professor Hackett. Glad to hear it. Then you should be ready to learn incendio. Fickle should servant. be, Professor. Yes. I'm sorry to say, I visited enough careless colleagues at St. Mungo's to assure you that Fire is a fickle servant. Your spellcasting has impressed well, me thus far, but please maintain focus. I would rather we not end today's lesson with your robes aflame. Let us begin. And remember, focus on the proper wand. Nice. A fire. Concentrate and keep your wand steady. <laughs> Good work. In the classroom before you go. I've set up a few targets for you. Send you. You're getting it. Keep <laughs> at it. And do try not to incinerate okay. yourself. Let me open. Accio. Incendio. It is. Protego. It's fun. Revelio. Alright, so now we can do that. Incendio. Pick up some more of those. I'm gonna feed the cat real quick. I'll be right back. I'll be right back.
transition back. Go ahead and cut this music. Alrighty. Alright. Whew. I like a weird headache today. Let's get back in here. All right, that looks good. I think everybody's everything's looking good for me here. All right. Looking good. Transition back up. I think the sound looks good. Testing, testing. All right, we're good. Just want to make sure I got, because like when I did the settings yesterday, I messed up and then like I had a 10 second delay on my game. So I want to make sure this thing sounds good before I get in here. I want to get too deep in and be like, you can't hear you. We can't hear you. I'm like, oh no. So sorry. I will do better. I think I'm going to try to play without headphones eventually because I just don't like having to put the headphones. I don't play with the headphones unless I'm like playing online, so it's weird. You know what I mean? Playing online with friends or whatever. So it's kind of weird now to play by myself with headphones on. I just feel like somebody's going to come through the door and spread my neck. Alright, so let's return to Fig's classroom. I've always said that travel nope. I'm supposed to go down. Man, I got a weird headache right now. Should have, uh... I felt it Rebellion. whenever I came in to the house today after I went to the doctor I was kind of like feeling weird I'm gonna grind it out nothing will stop us alright We've only got, you know, two hours in, so we've still got about, we probably want to go ah, another, there you are. another two to three hours, get a four, four to five hour stream in today. Ah, oh, so I'm just going to play this for a while. Hello, sir. You'll be pleased to know that I work for my defensive magic with Professor Hackett. It's going to have a little so bit of a headache right now. She tells me you've taken rather well to your new wand. You must continue to work with her and your other professors to improve your skills. That said, I don't wish to postpone our visit to the library any longer. So, shall we proceed? Fig, I have work for you. Come. Headmaster, I'm with a student and my schedule... Your schedule will wait indefinitely, as will your student. Oh, yeah. I would think that after all the trouble you caused me with Osric, you'd be eager to make amends. My office. Five minutes. That man <laughs> is exasperating. Unfortunately, our trip to yeah, the restricted also rare section will have to uh, wait a bit longer. But Professor, it's also we rare that no he even choice. posed. It would be unwise to provoke um, our illustrious headmaster further. Pictures I of shall his family find you like when that. I've completed That's whatever toils I must endure. It's usually a Zoa.
It's usually just Zoa, the Hawaiian sun. Ha <laughs> ha! Type thing. So it is interesting. Sebastian mentioned sneaking into the restricted section. Perhaps he'll have an idea. <sighs> uh. Excuse me. Yeah, we're going to do a little bit more of this main story to get opened up. Sebastian. And then we're out exploring. Probably to tomorrow. We'll probably do all that tomorrow. We'll be exploring. You know what I mean? The figuring out what's what type deal. Welcome in, welcome in. Looks like we just got someone else to join. Seems he's working with Ranrock. Ranrock is after something I found at Gringotts. Ranrock? And when were you at Gringotts? Professor Fig and I had this weird headache today. It's quite the tale. I uh, went to work. I was doing fine. I'm not sure I followed. Everything was good. I, I gotta be myself, getting over something. I, anyway, we ended up I gotta be like getting over a sickness or something. That map I just feel way more lethargic. You can't be serious. Deadly serious. I feel more Professor lethargic. My head hurts. Tell a soul about any of this. I've probably said too much. It's sleepy a lot lately. Your secret's safe with me. No, no. Whatever it is. Thank you, Sebastian. Not sure what it is. Being clever enough not to get caught in the restricted section, and I am. Meet me outside the library tonight, and tell no one. Thank you, Sebastian. See you tonight. And, and Sebastian's a G because literally, you know what I mean. We get caught. This dude doesn't say nothing. He takes the heat, which I appreciate. I'll move this out the way. Maybe there's too many snacks, I don't know. Just not feeling too good right now. See there? Come That's on. the door we need to Come reach. On. Come on. And those annoying prefects would love nothing more than to rat on us to Scribner. So don't let them see us. Understood? I can be sneaky. Let's go. <sighs> Hold on now. There's a spell you should know. The disillusionment charm. Good for getting places you're not supposed to be. Cast it and you'll appear <laughs> as little more than a trick of the light. Just as long as you keep your distance and stay quiet. You mean I'll actually be able to turn invisible? Something like that. It's not as foolproof as a cloak, but those are expensive. And spells, spells are free. Whew. Give it a try. Mm, here we go. Nice. All right, we're gonna go. There we go. I shall pretend I cannot see you. And so we're gonna wait. And we're through. Past. Librarian's still here. Quick, behind the bookcase. Damn. You told me the librarian would be gone by now. I said usually, but it'll still be all right. Do you see her desk behind me? The key is in the drawer of that desk. Now, Why don't we just wait? Here's like, what we're going to do. I'll can we just wait until she does go? You focus on getting the key. I'll Chill in the library for a little while. Restricted section. You distract. I get the key. Understood. I said I'd get you, and I always keep my word. <sighs> Trust me. Nope. I didn't realize it was going to automatically load it up for me there. Welcome in. Welcome in. I'm Commander John J. Back right now. We are in the library, about to get to the restricted section. 
It's our second playthrough. We turned the difficulty up. We played the first one on medium. So normal difficulty. We wanted to get a little bit... A little bit more challenging with this one. So we turned it on hard. Came back in as a griffin boar. Instead of a Slytherin. So... Right now, we're like we're probably in the first couple couple hours of the game. That wasn't so difficult after all. We just started doing the um the, book. the main storyline. That one's charms, but that is what it is. It's fooled me twice. Ooh. Never judge a tone by its cover, I say. Bam. There's still lots of things we need to get and do. We're doing that now. This is just the first one to get to get going. Alright, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Alright, so we want to aim there. Come back up the stairs. Revenue. Let the ghosts float by. Why would they go all the way up the stairs? That's never happened before. Nobody there after all. That's weird. Usually, huh? Okay. Let's try that then. Like, came all the way up the stairs. That was weird. Like, that's not where that sound came from. So I don't understand that at all. Revenue. That was weird. That's not how that happened the first time I did that. Make sure I'm not. Too close to that. Yeah, it was like the mighty Morphin right to me there. Should be in the drink. That was so weird. That dude's not even invisible. He's just like walking around down here, so what is fully out and about, trying to get caught. I'm looking for a cure to help my twin sister. And nice. she can return to Hogwarts. He's learning knows everyone else. Apparently. Why do you think we'll find a cure there in is a section? book down here the matron have nothing that can help her no, that is called the darkest of arts to Saint Mongo's. But or something like that I want to find that one no because that, right that is apparently the more. book that Voldemort Which learns precisely how to do horcruxes awfully cryptic I don't know where it is but I know it's down here So let's see if we can find it. Sorry, I've got an itchy eye. Give me one second. We're looking for the darkest Revenue. of arts book. But it's apparently where Voldemort learns about Horcruxes. Uh, let's see what we got here. I might have to look that one up to figure out where uh, where that is. Yay, five hundred! <laughs> Not sure. Ah, there it is. I'm impressed. Secrets of the Darkest Arts. And that's the one where he learns the Horcruxes. There's a Demi guys we gotta come get later. 
All right, let's see what we got going on here. Let's see what we got going on here. Ah, total chaos is live. We might tune in to his once we get down here. We'll definitely tune in over there. Watch his show. Ooh. We got a wand handle. Celestial blue. Nice. We'll use that one for now. Use that one for now. Let's put our hey we're on for now. I guess we could just do because right now we got this kind of stuff. So until we get some cooler stuff, we'll probably just go ahead and use what we do got. Oh, uh, yeah, let's do this. Let's go ahead and start off with what we do have here. Yeah, that's what we got right now. We'll go ahead and start off like this. There he is. Sebastian Solo and his new little friend. There he is. Exploring where they shouldn't be. Gonna get us in trouble. Sebastian's gonna have to take the fall. Sebastian, no. Alright. Oh, blasted peeps. I've got to stop him or at least get to the librarian with a good excuse for all of this. Wait, I don't want you getting into trouble for me. I have a way with the faculty when it comes to disciplinary matters. Besides, I like having friends who are in my debt. Now go. Good luck in your search. Now, where has that damned poltergeist got to? I know just the spell to repair this armor. Alright, so we need to repair this. Repair us. Rebellion. Prepare that. Come get this chest. Of course, traces of ancient magic. There must be more to this room. Ooh, okay. Go and put that thing on for now. We definitely need. Yeah, that gets us a lot better. I just jump us up a bit. Now we're not such a bum. We're going through this whole thing like a bum. That's it. Looking terrible. Rebellion. All right. All right. This is where the trial begins. Dark smithing attire. Again, this will jump us up. Nice little 23 point boost there. That's nice. Where might this lead? Where might this lead? Man, I don't know why I got such a headache today. But man, it hurts. Eat that hurts. Been a weird feeling all day. All right, here we go. Here we go. Here we go.
Rebellion. Not surprising. All right. Yep. The ready. Let's do it. Got to be closer than that. Ancient magic. Got to play a lot more defense in this Rebellion. one. Cause uh oof. Maybe if we yep. All right, we got a scarf. We got a scarf now. Alright, getting better. We need to find some better handwear, that's for sure. Let's go with that for now. No scarf. We're, we're graduating. We're going to college. We're graduating. We're getting better. Nice. It's like it's like we've done this before or something. It's like we've been here, done that. You know what I'm saying? It's like we've been there, done that. Been there, done that, sir. So we are grinding on this thing. What is going on? There we go. Rebellion. My computer screen keeps uh, having trouble here. Keeping up. Keeps looking frozen. This must be the way forward, but to where? Oh, my stream labs. Keeps looking frozen. Alright, let me do this. Oh, wait. Fingerless gloves. Man, we're getting way better. I'm so happy that we're actually getting this stuff looking good. What is going on with this? Why does it keep doing that? Why does my screen keep freezing? What's going on with my computer? What is going on with my computer right now? Yeah. Best I can do. Kitty, we're gonna have to make through. We're gonna have to make do with it, Kitty.
nearly there. Best keep my wits about me. There we go. Man, that's some good stuff here. Oh. You know, it just gets better and better. Because my dude wasn't very good. And now he's much better. And that looks just absolutely ridiculous. I'll keep this on for now. Alright. Alright, here we go. Yeah, come on. Yeah. Alright, we're gonna definitely have to do way more defense. Oof, we're gonna have to make some potions. It is a book after all. We're gonna have to make potions. We're gonna have to We're gonna have to focus on that one now. dried up. I am starting to feel better. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's just my cat being nearby. You good, baby? How was dinner? Did you have a good dinner? Did you have a good dinner, baby girl? Did you have a good dinner? That's my girl. That's my girl. Hey, baby girl. Hi. You want more love? Yeah. No love? You want to come right here? Come here. Come here, baby. Come here. No love? No. Alright. Good work, Percival. And she's like, Wanted to see me? The headmistress Fitzgerald. Professor Rackham. Miss Isadora Morganach. Welcome. Professor Rackham. Is that up there? Professor Bacar. We understand that you are adjusting well to life at Hogwarts. I am. I think that looks better. I am glad. 
especially in light of your unusual yeah. situation, starting as a fifth year. As it happens, I was also admitted to Hogwarts as a fifth year. I've never heard of another like us. Miss Morgan, when we spoke yesterday after class, you asked about the beautiful swirls you saw years ago when we visited your hammock. I recognized you all immediately. I cannot thank you enough for what you did. We were glad to help. And yes, I did see swirls she looks troubled. everywhere that day. My she looks like a troubled child. Imagination when you are she looks like she's going to be it troubled. Not your imagination. First of all, Professor Rackham can see them too. But we've never known of another who could. She looks like she's going to be trouble. The whispers or traces that appear when a particular form of ancient magic is wielded. Ancient magic? Few are capable of wielding it. Hogwarts itself is a stronghold of ancient magic. So if I can see traces of ancient magic, does that mean I can wield it too? With Oof. the proper training. But we might go we might go for another hour. Quick four hour stream. Before I can train you to wield uh, such magic. Oh why I got such a headache today. Master all that Hogwarts has I will to say offer. the stream has looked pretty good. I haven't even had to a magic this powerful use all the uh, the computer it must be wielded power on it. you not speak to anyone about what we've discussed here today. Mm. I should have kept more of an eye on her. She had that look. She had that look leaving the room of, oh, I can do whatever I want. Sebastian. in the restricted section again I had thought we were through with this mischief clearly detentions are insufficient I'm afraid I must take this to the headmaster but that being said he informs me that you didn't come alone tonight if someone has coerced you I would have you tell me you're a bright boy don't waste this. There was nobody else. I came alone. Oh, Sebastian. He had a what right to blind me. Sure did. All right, now we're level 10. We're working our way. I think there was something we couldn't wear yet, right? What was that? There it is. It'll give us a jump. Another jump. Yep, 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 yep. All right. Happy with that. Okay. So now we got much more, much more decent looking stats we got going on here. Let's do this. I think we should probably try to get to at least the first trial and then go from there. Because I feel like that will we'll be in a good enough spot. Rebellion. It's this way somewhere. Where's this thing at? Oh, 
you. All right. We're on our way on the Hogwarts stuff. We we start off hot. Rebellion. Can definitely hear it. Here's another one. All right, so let's go back. Let's get to Fig's class. Let's get to Fig's class. I definitely noticed that on the ray tracing, my it's definitely a little bit glitchier, and I struggle a little bit more. The uh, graphics and clipping and things. Ooh. All right. Some upgrades. All right. So level twenty or level eleven, twenty. So that'll be nice. The polyjuice potion. Watch that toilet. <laughs> Rebellion. Uh, so it's on the other side of this. It's over here somewhere. Probably inside of the locked door. Oh, oh, oh. But the good news is. another 500 which I need I need this stuff I need it bad Take the book to Fig. You cannot be serious. Goblins working with Rookwood makes, no, makes sense. no sense unless it, it does. Unorthodox, then it makes sense. The least. Unorthodox. Unless it does, it and then it makes sense. It's ah, Fig. You have a visitor. Rebellion. See what I can find out. Hmm. So. I was able to search the restricted section while you were with Professor Black. It was a book we were after. What? That's... Wait. You accessed the restricted uh. section? But how? Thinking uh. perhaps it's best you spare me the details. Fair enough. In fact, the book was below the restricted uh. section as it appeared on the map. I want to hear everything. First, let's have a look. Let's have a look. Of oh, course, there's pages oh missing. Some of these pages seem to be missing. It appears someone has got to the book before us. Well, of course. Still, I will need time to study what remains. 
Perhaps we can still salvage something useful. That may take some time. I wonder why it was here, below Hogwarts. I think I know, sir. I saw two more memories where I found the book. Another pensive. Godric's heart. The man we saw before, Percival Rackham, was a professor here. The first memory showed him and three other professors using ancient magic to restore a hamlet from a drought. Miriam was right. And the second memory? They were talking to a student who started as a fifth year, like I did. She could see traces of magic too. Why those memories? Hmm. Perhaps this book will explain. Now I'll have to take it with me to London. The headmaster has insisted that I speak directly to the minister about George's death. I understand. I'll see what I can learn about the missing pages while you're gone. Good. Don't neglect your studies. Your wand work is improving by the day. But you'll want to pay attention in herbology and potions. There's more to magic than spell casting. Plenty to keep me occupied while you're gone. You've done exceptionally well. I look forward to seeing all that you've accomplished when I return. The demigods in the oh, back. And don't neglect your friends. You may be surprised by how much you can learn from them as well. All right. We're making our way. Making our way. Bam! Almost to level eleven. Start off at one, so we on our way now. Rebellion. Looking good. Looking good. Meeting in Lower Hogsmeade nice. As soon as possible. I would like to talk to you about Rookwood and Harlow, and it might be best to do so outside of the castle. It's time to prove your dueling metal and see if we've a new school champion. Meet me at the usual place for the final round of Cross Wands. Also, the training dummy is still available. Ah, uh, now we got the world map. Now we can get out in the world map. Professor Fig and Weasley have asked that I teach you an additional defensive spell. Please complete the assignments I have given you, and then proceed to see me in my classroom. All right, Lower Hogsfield Herbology class. Successfully avoid enemy attacks by rolling and cast incendia. So, Herbology first, since we haven't been there yet. Let's do this first. Then we'll go out in the world. And we'll learn some stuff. Ooh, nope, not that way. We'll do a combination today of like the crazier stuff and a little bit more common sense. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gulpstones. I've been here before. I think this is where I met him the first time, so yeah, I think I've been here before. We're headed into here. Oh, yeah, that's a... Statue, yeah, because we got that one now. We already got that one. Yeah. There's something in there. Professor Garlic. There we go. Here we go. This will get us at three hours. Good morning, Professor Garlic. Wish you might. How wonderful it is to see you again. Oh, oh yeah. dear. A man, Drake. Oh, here, you need these. Today's class. Uh, um, uh, a little treat for your auntie. Class, please welcome the newest rose in our garden. We do look forward to growing together. How thrilling it is to have everyone back together again. 
This year will be filled with enchantment and excitement, but the most important thing cultivated in herbology is knowledge. The prudent herbologist is no more afraid of the venomous tentacular than the bouncing ball. Now then, today we will be acquainting ourselves with the mellifluous tuber known as the mandrake. Mandrake! Accio. Oh, Accio. <sighs> Let's see if we can't make our fibrous friends a bit more comfortable, shall we? First, let's protect our ears. Hmm. Now, everyone, grip the mandrake by the tendrils and give it a firm tug. There we go. Put it back in there. The soil should envelop the root like a warm, dirty blanket. Putting the mandrake right at ease. Recaro. I'm very sorry about that. Yours was a bit mature, I'm afraid. All right then, off you go. Splendid work, everyone. Now for our next task, we'll be planting dittany at our potting tables. You can all get started. I need to have a brief word with our new student. Hmm. I wonder if Hippogriff... Yes, Professor. Firstly, well done with your mandrake. They can be rather difficult to get a grasp of. Today, I, enjoyed I enjoyed it, it Professor. To catch your enthusiasm. How kind of you. It seems you're already taking to herbology yeah, like a mandrake to today, fresh man? soil. Now, as I mentioned, I like... next we'll be planting dittany. Let us find you some seeds. I My stomach have hasn't been right all day. You visited the magic meme. I don't know what's Wonderful. going on here today. A prepared student is bound to bloom. I've arranged for you to have your own potting table here I don't know what's classroom. going on. Wasn't easy to spare one on such late notice. It felt good. Stomach's been hurting. Now, and you can return to harvest them later. I don't know what's going soil, on there. Sunlight and a bit of magic. They will take time to grow. Let's see how to balance my. Pardon me, Professor. What's your part in all this? Teach me how to do this. Make it a vital ingredient in the wiggle milk potion. There we go. <laughs> well done. Once it can be harvested, your dittany will be ready to use in wiggle milk potion. Ah, it's, so pretty much just sharp, get me through all the really, really basic yeah. stuff. What say we branch out? Introduce you to a different sort of flora: the Chinese chomping cabbage. You'll find that some plants are better suited to uses outside of a cauldron. The cabbages do get testy without something to chew. Fortunately, I have a dummy for them to gnaw on. Be a dear, and let them have a good chomping. Yes, Professor. They're in the other greenhouse. It's just at the end of the footbridge leading out of this room. Your classmate, Mr. Pruitt, has kindly offered to accompany you. Come back and see me when you're finished. Oh, and mind your fingers. They do bite. Possess their own All right. Rocket, Neat. former beauty. Hello. Saw you on your way to Hogsmeade the other day. Nice to meet you. I'm Leander. Oh. I'll be showing you the Chinese chomping cabbages. Up these stairs will take us there. But oh, your lead. Rebelli. <sighs> nice work in defense against the dark arts, by the way. Excuse me. Your duel with Sebastian, and he's good. Huh. Thinks he's really good. 
But you outright slaughtered him. It was brilliant. Oh. Lulu's gonna take all oh. of this stuff. Thank you. I nearly put Sebastian in his place myself. I mean, I would have if Hecate hadn't stopped me. Didn't she stop that dragon skull from crushing you? <sighs> Typical Slytherin trick, dropping a dragon skull on someone during Rebellion. a fight. We think that lot down gone. there. You know that, of course. <sighs> Here we are. Home yeah, of the Chinese that. chomping cabbage. Go on. Grab it. Now, see that dummy? There we go. Just toss the cabbage. Let me <laughs> answer. They'll do the rest. Bam, we're gonna use this one. And I think on this build, we're gonna definitely use a bit more of the cabbage. There you go. There we go. Mouths on. Mum planted some in her garden last year to keep the gnomes out. Did save her the denoming, but they left her honking daffodils in tatters. I'm sorry. What do I need to do? Garlic said she wanted you to have a go at tending the cabbages. Give them some time to chomp and whatnot. Nothing to it, really. Just toss some of those Chinese chomping cabbages out. <laughs> You'll see fairly quickly why we call them that. Vicious little bastards, aren't they? My kind of plants. Not like stupid booba tubers and bouncing bulbs. The kind of plants that would have your back in a fight. Uh, not saying you can't go it alone, but well, imagine that wasn't a dummy. I suppose they could prove useful outside of the greenhouse. Nothing wrong with a bit of backup, even if it is from a cabbage. It's chaos out there. Trolls in Hogsmeade and such. You can't be above throwing a cruciferous vegetable if necessary. Dogweed and Deathcap has more of them, if you're keen. Other plants too. Ones your parents wouldn't plant in the garden. You get the idea. Anyway, we uh, probably ought to head back to class. Take your time. I'll see you back in class. Alright, return to Professor Gallic. Yeah, it's gotta be that right there. I am uh, going through it today. Sick in every way imaginable, it feels like. Head, stomach. Rebellion. reminder as to why we should always wear our dragon hide. I tended to the Chinese chomping cabbages, Professor. Remarkable plant. And good. As Magical plants have so much. I'm glad. <sighs> All right. We'll get a four minutes on that. Man, we're close. Only cost me my oh, that might be it for us. I am not feeling too good today. I'm just like kind of going through right now. I'm going through it today. Going through it. Potions class. Okay. Get potions class out of the way. Got a little bit more in. We can do a potions class. We can do that. Shouldn't there be always or someone from the ministry guarding the school after the incident? Rebellion. Hey, what? Where's this go? This might go to the Hufflepuffs. Oh, my gear slots are already full. I have to go to Hogsmeade. Let's do this. We'll get.
get this flower for the Weasley boy. For the Weasley. Potions is one of the most challenging and hazardous subjects taught at this school. As fifth years, you will be required to reach new heights of both discipline and intellect. You will begin this term by brewing a Wigan Weld potion. Mr. Takar, can you tell us why this particular potion might come in handy? Yes, Professor Sharp. The Wigan Weld potion can be used to sterilize and even heal a variety of injuries. It can heal some injuries, but not all. Point for Ravenclaw. Before today's class is completed, each of you will have brewed a wig and weld potion of your own. You never know when you might need it. Please begin. This is one where I definitely wanted to be a little bit more difficult to do it. Like, I just feel like we were able to Use do it a little a bit too easy. Even motion when crushing it's your literally ingredients. just... Uh, Please a be simple turning when motion. adding powder to your potions. One errant sneeze could be disastrous. Get A. It's not too difficult. And then, like, whenever you're, like, doing it in your room requirement, you're not doing any of that. I see most of you have not forgotten how to stir. Hmm. Not an easy potion to brew. Well done. And from what I hear of your recent exploits in Hogsmeade, you'd also do well to practice brewing the defensive Edurus potion. Professor Weasley had you acquire the recipe from Jay Pippins, correct? Yes, sir. Good. For the moment, you can find the ingredients you need in my office. But in the future, you'll be expected to provide your own ingredients. Some can be harvested from the plants you grow in your herbology class, and rarer ones can be purchased. Others, however, may be harder to obtain, and will require you to be a bit more... resourceful. Come and see me when you've finished <laughs> brewing. And we'll see if it was skill or luck the first time around. My Wiganwell potion is utter rubbish. Wish I could just replace it with one from J. Pippins. Don't fret if you run out of ingredients. I simply grow most of what I need. My parents considered keeping me home from school this year after the rumors of a goblin rebellion. Oh, can I not? Oh, yeah, I hear Professor Sharp say that you have permission. He did say that. Brilliant! You, my friend, you remember me, don't you? Gareth Weasley? Yes. Ah, yes. Of Listen, course. anyone with the trolls, I'm just missing one tiny last ingredient. I suspect that's where I come in. You're as clever as I'd hoped. I simply need a... I'll get you the last time I, I was like, yeah, it's not. This I'm gonna do something totally different. I'm gonna go get that feather fair. Cause then I got the feather. Wait until you see I got the feather and they didn't need it. He didn't, I feather. couldn't give it to him after that. I was like, but I got it. Cause I told him, no, I won't get it. Then I went in there. Rebellion. Gonna take everything in here we need. Missing here. I'm missing something here. Maybe, maybe it's at the very front potions class type thing. A well prepared witch or wizard always has a. Here's the fourth feather you wanted. Brilliant! Thank you. This is going. You should get back to brewing your endurance potion. Proficiency in potions are two things that cannot be rushed. Have patience and be thorough. So yeah, let me. And now we add the rebellion. And that's odd. What's happening? Wait, it's not supposed to. Ah! Oh, God.
I at least wanted to see because I didn't get to see last time because. Sorry, Professor. That'll be points from Gryffindor again. Mr. Weasley did not do this on his own. It was me. Brood in a Duras potion as you asked, Professor. I'm surprised you had the time. You seemed rather busy helping Mr. Weasley brew chaos. I'm sorry, Professor. I was merely trying to help a friend. Taking responsibility for one's actions does go a long way with me. I shall assume that you've learned a lesson. I wanted to do it just because last time I did it, and then I got the feather. And then it was like the feather was useless at that point. There's nothing I could do with it. Like, yeah, at least this time, let me just... I'm glad I was able to meet your expectations. Let me just do it like that. And you do well to remember that you're not a potions master quite yet. In addition to having a solid grasp of how to combine various ingredients, you should gain an understanding of the ingredients themselves. Pay particular attention in herbology. The plants you nurture there are often essential <coughs> to the potions you brew here. Now, I recommend that you find a safe location in which to practice brewing. You cannot leave a hot cauldron simply anywhere. That'll be all. That will be all. All right. Each of us has had enough excitement for one day. Class is dismissed. There we go. Potions class is done. Level 11. We're ranking up. Excuse me. I know there was a level 11 one in here somewhere. Where is that level 11? There it is. Not like gamey too, but... It's still better. We're going to go back to our... Go back to what we started with. We got that one to do. Spell comma 